All right, YouTube, I know it's been a while since I uploaded my last video, but that's because I've been filming this one a little bit every day for the last week, as promised in my last video. I've been on this thing pretty hard, uh, the Intech Swing Trainer. Now, I couldn't find videos online for actual practice with this thing, but what I did find was a club called the Momentus, which weighs a little bit less. I think it's a little bit shorter, but it's basically the same thing. So I've been pulling their drills from the momentous videos and running them on this club which is pretty simple so this thing has a fixed grip on it essentially you just lock your hands in it kind of makes you hold the club i can't lace my fingers it doesn't feel good but this is uh pretty much forces you to do this number here and then the drill is to take this club a couple inches forward let it pendulum swing back up hold it for a second and then come right back through and hold for a second and so they recommend that you do this 5 10 15 20 times a day which is what I've been doing and they recommend that on the range you swing it about five times hit 10 balls swing it five times hit 10 balls and then it's supposed to make your game better over time so Today I'm going to hit it on the range and just kind of show you what that looks like. Someone save me from how I've done Please don't blame me for all my past Everything we can see is just a job, nothing more Everything we call it true, suddenly will kill ourselves Get mad, get mad, the speed is deep inside of me Wasting time, but it's fun, but in the left can make me real Get mad, get mad All right, folks, so I wanted to wrap up the video on the Momentous Swing Trainer, but I'm gonna do a quick behind the scenes update on what's been going on. So this used to be the poker room and it used to have a closet right there where the missing floor is. But as you can see, this whole room's been taken apart, got a fresh coat of paint, everything's been taken out. We're about to fix the flooring. And then this whole back wall is gonna have a desk from corner to corner. Once that's up, I'm gonna get the computer set up and I'm gonna get Adobe Premiere. So my editing is going to get a little bit better as I run better software. And then since I'm using real software, I won't have to edit everything on my phone. And then that means I can use more camera angles than just my phone. So the camera is going to get better as well. So that's coming up as we move. Going to get out of that room because it echoes pretty bad in there. Um, I have nowhere to put my camera, so I'm going to walk around like a madman. As you can see, everything that was in that room is pretty much either in the living room or piled away in the spare bedroom. So, so I don't really have anywhere to set my camera down, so I apologize as I walk around all crazy with the phone in my hand. So, wrapping up the moment of Swing Trainer, it makes a lot of claims. They say they're gonna fix your grip. They say they can fix your over the top swing. They say they can fix your slice. They say you can get more distance out of the ball by using this momentous Swing Trainer. So let's address those. Does the ball go further? Yeah, my balls are going further. Did it fix the over-the-top swing? Only when I really thought about it. Only when I really sit there and think about, all right, take the club back like this and come through like that and don't come over the top. That's what fixed it more than anything, even with the swing trainer. Um, it did fix my grip a little bit. I still slice the ball. As a matter of fact, I'm slicing them more now than I used to. I used to just send them dead left as I came over the top and would just send them out to the left. But now, now they actually do have like a little fade to them. So all in all, the thing's three pounds. It makes your golf bag heavy. I don't like it being in the bag as I play around and just banging against everything for nothing. So I constantly find myself using it on the range to warm up then going all the way back to the car to put it away, and then going and playing my round. Um, so it's just kind of a pain.
Now I do like the fact that I can just sit in my driveway and swing a couple shots every day and work on my swing every day. So I'm probably gonna keep it around. I'll probably keep using it and messing with it. But I think the days of taking it to the range every day or taking it with me somewhere every day and working on it, those are probably done. I'll probably play with it once a month just to kind of keep things in tune. So all in all, it's okay, but I don't think it does all the things they, they claim that it does. I think, you know, like most things, it's, it's easy to claim stuff. It's another thing to deliver. It is definitely not a cure-all, but it helps. So that's kind of cool. All right, guys. So other than that, just like, share, and subscribe if you could, because it really helps when you subscribe to the channel right now. It's a small channel that's growing. Comments, likes, shares, subscribes, that stuff goes a long way. So subscribe to the channel uh, and come back for the next one.